Today, we're going to see what value partnering with a trusted robot integrator can bring you and your business. So, Andrew, you are a system integrator, and we're going to find out a little bit more about your relationship with Fanuc in a moment. But can you tell me more about yourselves as a company? Oh, we're a company that's been in business 20 years plus. Uh, we specialise in automation systems, predominantly in the pharma and the uh, dairy industry, some water. We also get involved with all sorts of weird and wonderful things along the way as well. So tell me about this project behind us. So this project's uh, off to Toronto. It's going to get uh, four machines fully automatically running now. At the moment it's all manually operated and people can't get the staff. So they're, they're running very low utilizations because they haven't got the labor to, to run the plant. And this is going to get them up to 100% utilization. They're going to make a lot more product without any staff. So why should people use a system integrator then? Well, a lot of our customers, they don't actually know what they want. They just know that they want to automate something. And that's where we come in, because we've got this experience. We've been doing this for many, many years. I dread to think how many hundred years experience we've got of all the staff here. Uh, so we come up with a solution for them. We like to think we're solutioneers. We find that the solution to their problem. So what do you see about robot adoption? Because obviously it's increasing so much. Robot adoption is going to compete, continue to increase. People are really struggling to get staff. And a robot can, can take the place of many, many staff that they just can't find. So we're getting utilizations up. They can make far more product than they used to be able to with the same amount of staff. And, and that's going to just increase over the years. So how do you choose what robot manufacturer to, to go for? Well, we used to use other suppliers over the years, but we've now settled on Fanuc as our main partner just because they're really, really easy to deal with. None of the, the lead time issues, the problems. Before we used to get, it'll be 38 weeks, and that was the end of the conversation. Well, now Fanuc, if we say, well, we can't wait 38 weeks, they normally come up with a solution. They'll go out of their way to find a solution to, our, to help us get the project out on time. And touch wood, so far, every project we've done on time with Fanuc's help. Kind of... Fanuc is such a big brand, but you're telling me that at the end of the day, it's people behind it. Absolutely. Uh, Dan, our sales manager from Fanuc, he looks after us great. He comes and sees us whenever we have a project on. He, he lets us know when there are issues. He lets us know of lead time problems, manufacturing issues at Fanuc, just so we know everything that's going on and uh, we can work around it. And as a team, then we never have a problem. So, Dan, you're from Fanuc. What is it that you're doing to help system integrators use your products? Yeah. I think in a couple of words, it's service and support. Uh, we realise that for our integrators to go further, to push boundaries both uh, technically and kind of gaining the, the end customers and the end users they want to get to, they need the support and the technical kind of advice from us. And that can be in many different ways. That can be from on the, sh uh, the shop floor support if something goes wrong, but also right up to kind of upskilling, making sure that their workforce is right where they need to be. So what do you think is the benefit for the end user when they're working with a system integrator? It's knowledge, for sure. Um, having an, an individual system integrator work with an end user depending on the skill they need. So for example, we have welding partners. You would want a welding partner to help you out with a welding job. If you are, are doing a packaging or processing or palletizing line, someone like LS Mechatronic would be brilliant for you there also because they know what they're doing. Um, from the outset, a lot of these jobs seem simple, but these guys have picked up a lot of things along the way and they've learned so many different uh, unknown unknowns um, that they've come through them. So it's definitely about putting the right people in place so the project can run smoothly and correctly. Fanuc were great with the support. Uh, they train four of our staff for free. Um, we have open invites to go up to Coventry and they look after us regularly. You know, when there's new bits of kit out, we want to see it, they'll uh, show us. Um, Mebin, who's our lead robot engineer, he uh, speaks very highly of them compared to the competition because he just picks up the phone and they help. Uh, we had an issue last week where we forgot to order particular part of the safety system uh, and uh, I rang up uh, Dan, our sales uh, engineer, and within four hours their engineers were online to our laptops installing the safety system. We, we have never seen that elsewhere, you know, it was literally done the same day and it was our mistake, not Fanex. So they're a great partner. Let's go technical now then, tell me more about this system. Okay, this system is for packaging four uh, lines, making containers. Uh, we are erecting cardboard trays, so they put cardboard sheet into the machines. We create a tray out of it, we fold it and form it. The robot picks it up and places it onto a pallet, which we've already collected from a magazine and placed on the conveyor. It then loads the product up to the top, putting uh, trays on the pallet as it goes. And then it puts a tray on the top, inverted. It then conveys the system to a wrapper and a strapper. 
the product is then fully wrapped, it's labelled and then it's presented to the forklift area to be collected and put into the warehouse. Could they have done this before? At the moment everything's done by hand and they can't run their lines because they don't have enough staff and they can't get the staff. So now their utilisation should go through the roof because they can run this 24-7. So what range of robots are you using then and how do you choose them? RoboGuide, the Fanex software, chooses the robots for us. We put in what we need to do and it figures out exactly what we need. We tend to try and focus on this particular robot behind us. Uh, that's our mainstay uh, and we'll use them sometimes even if they're too big for the project. But then if we need to go really big, we can obviously go up to the half ton robots and the really, really big stuff. Um, we just use what's right to, for the particular project. So what are the other tools and benefits that the robots offer you as an integrator? We're a big fan of RoboGuide, their simulation software. We can uh, do a complete software write-up and uh, demonstration to a customer. They can see exactly what it's going to do, so they get the comfort that they know it's going to work. Um, and it de-risks it for us. You know, we know it's going to work before the robot's turned up because we've already done all the software and all the simulation. That's the main, for us, that's a great asset for, from Fanuc. Someone else watching this, they could be a system integrator. So what would you say is the main takeaway for using Fanuc as a company? to benefit yourselves towards your clients? We just find that we've got a partner rather than a supplier with Fanuc. You know, they work with us to create these projects to make sure they're successful. They point out the pitfalls if they can see them. So for us, Fanuc are a key partner. Uh, we're not on our own just buying a robot. We've got a partner.